after playing for a little bit, I managed to level up and get the brand new gunsmith unlocked so I could take a closer look at it. In this video, I will be exploring for the very first time the brand new gunsmith as well as getting to see for the very first time the brand new weapons that we get to play with. I also look at things like the new perk system, lethals and tacticals, stuff like that. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a like and comment down below. I don't know, your favorite fruit? Yeah. Let's do favorite favorite fruit today. The engagement helps out the channel a ton. And speaking of which, make sure to share this video with a friend as that helps out too. Also make sure to subscribe and enable notifications as this was live streamed here on the channel and I intend to be doing more of those, so make sure you don't miss them. But with that said, let's get to it, shall we? Let's start this. I wanna try the, the same mode again, but I want to try a different loadout. Um, I would also love to see if it's possible interface. Can I get like FPS and stuff? up uh custom show more fps counter on server latency on packet loss on i just find it nice to have doesn't look that that awesome oh actually it doesn't look half bad 30 for a match oh look guys i'm getting 148 fps <laughs> okay the valderas museum i'm gonna try this one now of the move up I'm expecting someone here. Headshot? Nice. Good job, actually. I really, I must say, I really do like the movement, the feel, like the feel of the game. Okay, this gun. Actually, doesn't have too bad of a recoil. I must for the first three weeks. I have no idea what that guy said. <laughs> but the recoil isn't that bad on this gun, I don't feel. I'm all down, can't spice. Grenade, I'm pretty sure. Got a cruise missile. No, oh, that's a gas <laughs> thing. I didn't even get to see that guy. Well played with that gas. That was that was good for him. Ow! I didn't see the guy before it was too late. Okay, uh, kill streak two. That's what I needed. There we go. Oh, there we go. Uh, cruise missile. I don't. Uh, sure, that guy. Ha! Got him. Nice. I got 10 kills. I'm almost leading with kills in, uh, in our team here. Double kill. Is that a sniper? What? I can... That's a quick swap. That's a new mechanic. So I can kind of switch and then I can... That's awesome. Okay, we got people down here. Three kills. Uh, that felt good. That felt good. 
Your aim is good, thanks. <laughs> it could be better though. But I mean, practice Inside. makes perfect, right? Okay, victory. Did I win? Ah, almost. Nice. Okay. I got cut. Oh, I got to feature custom loadouts and perks. Okay, that's sick. Okay, cancel that. I got access to the brand new this thing. Okay. First of all, I want to adjust my kill streaks a little bit. UAV, definitely all for it. Cruise missile. Uh, okay, these are locked. Unlocked at level 86. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's fine. Right. Weapons. I got loadouts here so custom loadout one and I can add a new loadout so I wonder what the limit will the, for this will be so but this is my first custom loadout uh, custom loadout one so we got the M4 let's take a look at what weapons we actually got here so assault rifles we got five weapons at the current stage of the game we got the M4 well this is the M4 here the lash that's I think German Lachman Lashman I'm, I'm butchering that Lash the Lachman uh, <laughs> <laughs> right here, we got the M16, the Custom 74U, and the TAQ56. So these are the assault rifles. Then we got battle rifles, which is the FTAC Recon and the Latchman 762. Uh, SMGs, we got the uh, Latchman Sub, the, FF, the FSS Hurricane, and the Fennec 45. Shotguns, we got the Expedite 12. LMGs, we got uh, 556 Icarus. Rap H and Seeking MG38. Maxman rifles, we got the Lockwood MK2 and the LMS. Sniper rifles is the Signal 50. All right, so all of these for me right now are locked. I need to unlock them at certain points, I assume. And I'm unlocked at level 11, and these are just locked, it seems. I got the shotgun, I got none, none of the SMGs. Uh, item unlocks at level 25, level 16, just locked. So I got, I got limited options here, but I can still do this. So if I go to Gunsmith, okay, so apparently I need to unlock sections of the gun at certain levels, I think. So if I go to Optic, I can't actually enter any of these until I level the weapon up further. Currently it's at level 1, and I can't access any of these until then. Progression? Ah, so you unlock certain other weapons after you unlock... Okay, so... This is actually cool. You can enter a barrel? Okay, thank you. I'll do that in a second. I have the M4 here. When I reach this to level 17, I'll unlock the Ikaros. When I get this to level 12, I can unlock the next gun, etc. So this is the weapon tree, which is cool. So if I see track on this, then I can see the different attachments that I can unlock. Uh, so we got things like the under barrel here, the stock and the rear grip. And then from my understanding, these things right here that I unlock from the M4, I will be able to use that other guns as well. Battle rifle unlocked at M4 level 12, and then I can continue down this path, and etc. So that is very cool. I hope that's understandable. I hope that makes a little bit of sense. I'll know more when I get more stuff unlocked. But you said, yes, I can actually add a barrel. So we got locked barrels. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't say when it gets unlocked. I think I just need to keep using these weapons here. I like this. I'll be able to know more when I start getting st uh, stuff unlocked and things like that. And then we'll get back to it. Customize. <laughs> Beta stuff. Stickers. I don't really... Okay, you know what? I'll I'll run with a... No, you know what? I, I don't like stickers. It's distracting. Uh, camos are locked, of course. Shock stick. Uh, electrical device that sticks to surfaces. Electric shoot enemies destroys equipment and causes vehicles to go haywire. Uh, medical syringe unlocked at level 17. So I can either do flash grenade, decoy to grenade. I'm gonna do flash grenade. Thermo should probably be Semtex. And then we got this system here, the perk packages. And I'm not sure how these are actually going to work. So we got a few different things here. I can also create a package. So assault has overkill, scavenger, fast hand. I'm gonna make my own. I'm gonna make, create a package here. Overkill carry two primary weapons. That's nice. However, we could switch it out for Double Time, Battle Hardened, uh, the Scavenger, EOD, Tracker, Strong Arm, or Extra Tactical. Born with one additional tactical, see a preview of the trajectory of 
thrown equipment. That's cool. Enemies leave behind a footprint. I love this one. Uh, take it, reduce damage from non kill streak explosives. Reduce the effect of enemy flash, stun EMP. Increase crouch movement speed by 30%. I'm gonna do tracker. And then resupply ammo and throw knives from dead players. And then double time. Okay, then we got fast hands, which reload, use equipment, and swap weapons faster. We can also do resupply. Uh, which spawns with an additional lethal equipment recharges over 25 seconds, which is the most important part here. So your equipment, when you use a grenade, you automatically get one after 25 seconds. A spotter, a spot enemy equipment, field upgrades and kill streaks through walls, aiming down sights, highlights them for the team, hack enemy claymores, proximity mine, C4 and trophy systems. Cold-blooded, undetectable by AI, we've seen that before. Uh, does not trigger high alert warning, does not highlight in enemy tactical cameras, recon drones and spotter scopes. Reload use equipment and swap weapons faster. Killing players immediately triggers health regeneration. I... Hmm... I think I'm gonna do that. Reduce kill streak cost by one kill. Reduce score streak cost by 125. We can also do high alert ghost, which makes us undetectable by UAVs. Of course, high alert visual pulses when spotted by an enemy outside of the screen. War clock store an additional field upgrade charge. Increase field upgrade charge rate by 40%. And then we got survivor on death. Enter last stand with the enter last stand with the ability to self-revive once per life. I am gonna go with high alert because I love high alert. So this is the one that I have made. I think I can rename it to custom, custom one. So this is so this is my custom loadout right now. I do however want to change the tactical. When left on its own, the camera will monitor the area, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what this means, but it's locked, so doesn't matter. Uh, what do I want here? Deployable cover, trophy system, tactical camera, munitions box, inflatable decoy, and DDoS. Activates the device that de deactivates electronics and disrupts enemy sensors. Yeah, that sounds good. I want to know though. Where is it? Yep, heartbeat sensor unlocked. Sun level 28. 28. Nice. So this is my current uh, custom loadout. I think I could go ahead and rename it. M4, just like that. All right, let us jump into another game. That was a lot of talking and a lot of... Uh, blabbering, rambling. I want to go in again, and this time I want to run with my own loadout. 